So in the rainforest, these guys are also uh. detritivores. <laughs> <laughs> They actually, you know, if they know something's in the tank, they swim around very fast and don't stop until they catch it. They're very cute. So this cup is kind of right under the heat lamp. Uh, Java and Grogu, but don't ask me which one is which. They were originally named when one was a good fair amount larger than the other, but now they're both. One is actually a few months older than the other. Yeah, once a week I go in and I kind of clean out the tank, pick out any dead crickets they didn't eat, pick out frog poop, which is very gross, and clean their water dish because they make a mess of it every week. That one. <laughs> That's a big one. I put 20 in there every week. They will eat pretty much all 20 a week. This initial feeding frenzy, they'll knock out like half of them. I mean, I think that one's had four already. And then once they're done eating, and I've cleaned all of their little decorations, then the tank goes back together and I go back to that light. They just make like a weird little chirp on the nose. Oh, okay. It's, it's very cute. So in the wild, they are mostly nocturnal hunters. They come out and eat some at night. There you go. For a bath. Giant rainforest cockroaches. So in the rainforest, these guys are also uh. detritivores. <laughs> they eat stuff that's kind of breaking down, which is a very important job in the rainforest because there's, you know, countless plants and animals living in the rainforest and everything dies eventually. So as it breaks down, these guys help de you know, decompose it. Mm. <laughs> uh, we've got... Oh. We've got three adults and three juveniles. Which ones are the adults? The ones with the wings. Oh, so they okay. will all have wings eventually, but they only get them once they're kind of full grown. They can glide. So they're like, not very good. Like they don't, can't really do like vertical takeoff. Um, but they live, like I said, they live in the rainforest and they live, you know, high up in the trees. And they're very, very good climbers. So they can climb straight up a tree hundreds of feet. Uh, and then they'll use those wings to glide down from branch to branch, you know, like to escape from predators or just to move somewhere else or not, you know. Deprived him of his precious cup for 10 minutes. 